Hello, welcome back to Cool Prints Today. I'm Tim, and today we're printing the miniature Chewbacca, a file that I got off a of Thingiverse. And uh, I actually printed this on my new CR10 that I purchased just a little bit ago. And I'm very happy with the CR10, but this is my first print, and I was using a different software at the time. I used Cura, uh, but now I actually use Simplify 3D. Here, what I'm trying to do is prepare painting of the model. I'm trying to use some of the paint I have in here at the house. Uh, I stopped printing late in the day and I didn't have time to go purchase the paints. I was kind of busy that day with some shirt printing. So I'm just mixing some, uh, some blue and some orange to try to get the brown. As you can tell, I've already got, I've tried different paints. That's why Chewbacca is actually a different color now that you see. I'm getting kind of close to the color I'm wanting for him. Still not perfect though, by no means. And as you see, I'll have to, here in a little bit, I actually have to go purchase uh, some different inks because this just wasn't working for me. Always want to show you guys though what works, what doesn't. That way you can kind of decide what you want to do if you're going to paint this particular model. There you can see the layer shifting on the model itself. I think it was just a setting. I don't think it was a file. I think it's just the settings in the Cura. I highly recommend getting Simplify 3D. Uh, this makes life so much easier in the prints that I've done that you'll be seeing here in future videos. I'm actually using Simplify 3D and uh, it makes better prints. As in, the, as in all videos that I make, uh, down in the description you'll see where to get the file, see who created the file, and then I'll also leave some links of the, of like the PLA and the stuff that I've used if you're wanting to get some yourself. Alright guys, uh, this is it. This is a picture of the finished product. It turned out pretty good with the colors, I think. I just want to thank you for watching this video, and be sure to uh, like and subscribe. Alright guys, catch you in the next video. Bye.